Okay, so right now we'll be doing a side-by-side -side comparison between these two devices. Xiaomi 14 having the new Xiaomi Hyper OS version 1 and the Xiaomi 13 Ultra is currently sporting the older Xiaomi MIUI 14. But this device will be getting a Hyper OS update this coming quarter 1 of 2014. But I think it's good for us to know what have changed along the way. Let's get it started. So we'll see this is the default lock screen on both phones. So un unlocking it, this is what you'll be seeing for, on, for both phones. And of course, uh, we have customized it to the way that I like it for this one. So yeah, basically you'd see the interface has changed a little bit, but the icon seems to be quite a little bit the same except that of the camera button. You can see the camera button here, the uh, lens is looking a little bit bigger. This one is a little bit smaller. And the setting icon seems to be a little bit different this time around. The gallery icon looks different and definitely there are quite some changes here. So let's start off with the notification bar. So when you drop down, you'll see this, uh, the difference between the two. Uh, on the MIUI 14, you'll still see the uh, signal bars over here and the battery while on the other one the hyper os you no longer see the battery and of course your signal bar now if you um, close everything that's how it looks like so if you drop down here on the menu bar this is what you'll see this is a total revamp this is basically a total revamp if you uh, take a good look at it so uh, you'll see two most important icon here the wi-fi and the mobile data you'll see it here on the miui 14 but you'll see it on top for the hyper os and this one that didn't change though it's a little bit smaller this time around then uh, me smart hub it's the different placement over here then of course the uh, music playback it's an, on another uh, location and this one is the major change. So you would see that uh, all of the shortcuts here are hidden on the lower half of the screen. While this one, you can swipe it over and check it here. Now, uh, while the MIUI 14 uh, has a more limited space over here. Now, if you want to add all of the icons, you just have to swipe on a third screen. So... Uh, let's just say want to add all of them in into this one done so you see a third screen over here now if you're taking a look here on the hyper os do i want to add everything here all of them would be just simply below the screen all you need to do is just simply swipe up there's more toggles here uh, uh, to be honest with you as compared to Xiaomi MIUI 14. Okay, so if you swipe it up, you'll see all of the shortcuts over here. And yeah, I, I feel it's a lot more option on the Hyper OS as compared to the MIUI 14. Now, if you check some widgets over here, so let's just see and, uh, and let's just simply have some fun and check what we can get here from the widgets. Okay, so uh, the problem here is that it takes a little while to load because this is a China ROM. Well, both of them are China ROM to be to be uh, on the fair play, a uh, fair comparison. So yeah, basically it's almost the same. I didn't really see too much changes on the uh, widgets that you can add. Okay, so um, not too much changes okay, if you ask me. Uh, let's just quickly take one and compare um, let me see something the same uh, let's take for example this one okay so uh, the weather forecast widget okay so both of this uh, weather forecast widget let's just simply add it over uh, to our screen 
So this is what you see. Uh, basically, it's uh, looking the same, except that the color seems to be a little bit different. Clear it out. It's just uh, simply set it to the right location. Okay, so uh, basically we have the same forecast over here, but we would see that this one render it to be a little bit darker compared to the MIUI 14. Probably that's the difference. Okay, so if we swipe it over here, you'll see all of the widgets is also here. Okay, so uh, on top, this one still has the clock. This one doesn't have the clock anymore. And looking at it, it kind of looks still almost the same. Okay, so nothing really has changed that much. So let's just simply go into the camera app. Now, uh, probably this is one of the more intriguing for me. Let's just see if there's any changes. But basically, if you take a good look at it, it's exactly the same for the pro mode. Then uh, let's just see for other like documents, it's the same. Uh, for photo, yeah, it looks the same. And if you want to um, zoom it, it's, uh, there's the dial. And you want to zoom it, it's also, there's also the dial. They want to change from Leica Authentic to Leica Brian, just press this button. And if you want to check more menu, just, just uh, swipe it down. You can, well, freely play with it. And basically, the camera app is the same. So probably one of the uh, main changes here is this one. You would see uh, Hyper OS here and Xiaomi Mi 14 over here. And the placement is a little bit different this time around. You can see all of the quick specs out here, but you don't know, but you won't see it here on the Xiaomi Mi 14. Like check the detailed info information specs. You'll see everything here. Nothing really different. Now on inside, you would see uh, the interconnectivity and more connectivity option is here, but you don't see it here on Xiaomi. Maybe you'll be checking inside here, but not really. All the other notifications, all of the other options here are, well, basically almost the same. Nothing really has changed that much. So the learning curve from Xiaomi MIUI 14 to the Hyper OS won't be a big problem. So before we end, let's just quickly see some wallpaper customization. This is what you'll be seeing here. So uh, basically, everything being underneath here are almost the same. Uh, except the placement over here. Okay, so uh, wallpaper and themes. Okay, you see it here, but here you will see the wallpaper and themes. Now, fonts and effects, it's here. And fingerprint, everything is uh, pretty much a big icon over here. Uh, you see the AOD here on top and the icons here. It's just the change of the placement, but basically the menu is exactly the same. Let's just check AOD, it's exactly the same. Now if we check icons, it's yeah, basically the same. Now guys, what do you think of the changes from the MIUI 14 to the Hyper OS version 1? Hit me on the comment section below and let me know what you think. And if you like this video, don't forget to give me a like. And of course, a sub to this channel will be exciting. I'll see you soon. And so, I'm Parasir Richmond, and you're watching Gadget Sidekick. Watch out! Like and subscribe to my channel. Don't forget to hit that notification bell. For one of my latest uploads, click the Dito. And for one of my popular uploads, click here.